I am your surgeon for this operation today. My name is Mr. Flare Bliss, and welcome to Mind Donor. You take the role of Victoria Frankenstein as she ventures her lab, collecting the pieces to finish her creation. As you do so, you'll soon find out the motive of her research. It's a very green game, and it's a prequel slash proof of concept for a much more fleshed out game, which hopefully will be a thing in the future. Let's see, new game. Tonight, the night. This is where all my hard work has led to. I found an un a way, sorry, to undo death with my assistance. Those who have left us shall walk among the living once more. But first a new vessel is needed to house their mind. A vessel of my creation. Hmm. I need to collect all the pieces. I must have left them around here somewhere. Also looking through the comments within the Echo page of this game, which you can find down in the description below. There's apparently a secret in all this, which I could discover. You pick up a bottle and read the label. Formula hide, whatever you want to call it. I don't know how to pronounce it. A uh, casual. And this one doesn't have a scientific name to it. One must always wash their hands before surgical work. Surgical, sorry. Surgical. <laughs> Don't flip the switch. Not yet. Look, I'm going to keep going at this until we get the activation of being able to flip the switch, okay? And it doesn't matter how long it takes us to be able to try and do this, I am going to get this switch flipped no matter how long we sit here and keep interacting with this. Okay, we should press on with our time. People will be like, it only takes a bit of life, but it only takes one more and you could have done it, Flair. Nope, I'm not reading you. I'm not reading your comments. I'm not reading anything that you people say. I'm just kidding. I don't need to go in there yet. Okay, so two things that we could either go in or interact with, but not at this point in time. So I wonder what this secret has entailed. Most of this must have gone off by now. There's a gross meat smell. Okay. Jars and bottles. Very jarring. Okay, what's over here? Something here. Let me interact with it. Nothing here. It's stale. Stale. Just like my commentary skills. Bacon ingredients. When the time comes, I'll make myself something nice. Hmm. Capital I for Isle. It's locked. Why? Again with a lag. Um, why would I lock a door in my own facility? Oh, there's something in here. Wait, no, it's just a moth. Look, okay, all things have significance. No matter how major or minor they may be, they all have significance at the end of the day. You're just going to find yourself within the discovery through life. We're all in this discovery of life together. It is not just on an individualistic basis. You are, after all, not the main character of your own story. You are one piece, like this torso, for example. <laughs> Her body. Her body must have been sculpted by the gods. She was a delight to behold. At times, I would awaken with her arms wrapped around me, her body pressed against me. In those moments, I would return to my slumber, only now with a smile. I remember, while she hid my pillow so I would rest my head on her instead. This is really romantic. Even now I get flustered thinking about it. She was always fond of her little pranks, wasn't she? Yes, I am no god, but I hope this new form will suffice. Well, only time will tell. Are you sure you're able to undo the death of somebody? But also, the question that you have yourself is, if you can successfully resurrect someone, would you... F Damn, I want to free all of them. Um, would that mean that you will go through the pain again of witnessing their death? These monsters are a sign of success. I don't know what to do with them now, though. Aww. I'll let him go soon enough. I have no use for life subjects anymore. You better do so. Uh, 
Huh? Has one of them escaped? Yeah, looks like the gate has escaped. Oh dear. Looks like we might be chewed up and spat out. Good boy. Oh, I just want to free all of them. Developer, is a way to free all these? Oh no. Oh. It doesn't look too willing to move. But we need to think that's within the corner. Maybe we can find a way to persuade it. Um, we could do... Where's the save points in this game? If we can't save in the menu, then where can we save within the game? This leads upstairs. I don't need to go there. Are you sure we don't need to go up there? I'm sure we do need to go up there at some point, but just not right now. The pantry, there might be something in there to deal with that dog. Uh, something here. Oh, over here. Ah, oh, gained item, dried me. Why isn't this in the freezer room? How long has this been here? Gross. That's what that smell was. Right, let us try and deal with this thing, if we can. Let's see. Hello? I have this for you. It snatches the meat out of your hand. And then it goes into the corner. Okay. Obtained items, arms, her hands. How I wish to hold them again. I remember her hands, how small they were compared to mine. They look relatively the same size, I'm not gonna lie. How they always fiddled around in the kitchen, dusted with flour. At night her hands would melt into my body as to her warm as her warm embrace lulled me to sleep. Whenever her hands graced my own and I felt the softness of her skin, I knew all would be alright. Soon, my love, I shall hold you once more. Wei Xiao is trying to eat. White seeks out food when it isn't capable of digesting, I'm not sure. Well, it still has the ability to harbor the desire to eat food. Like, just because you've been resurrected does not mean that your eating habits will change, even if you don't actually gain anything out of it. If you have the inability to digest, if that makes any sense. But what's this way? And what's up here? Oh, still nothing. Still absolutely the equivalent of nothing. Which is nothingness. Void. Zil. Null. Her drafts. I don't want to read them. Not now. Why not? Pomophius. Pomophius. How do you want to pronounce it? Oh, freezer room key. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Hmm. I feel like the secret has to be either the back room where we start or the switch. Slash proof. Ah, oh, hates. Hmm. Or when there's something there or something along those lines. A thick layer of dust has accumulated at the top of books. I don't want to clean that. Nobody want to clean that empty. Oh dear, the back wall, P dreadful, dreadful. It's a book of baby names. We might as well just have a book of names. Like, we'll grow up with these names when we get older. Unless we change them, it's always going to be with us for our entire lives. That's a thing, right? Baby names. Why can't it just be names rather than baby names? Because they go from a baby to a child to a teenager to an adult. The Lord of the Manor, uh, beside the shelf. Okay, now we've got legs. Now we just need the head. Her legs. She was Amazonian in height. So really tall. Every time I wish to plant a kiss on her lips, I would have to stand on my tiptoes. And every time I would do so, she couldn't help but laugh. How embarrassing. But it brought her joy. That was all that mattered to me. She and I would run along so after each other in the park. The mud we kicked up dirty in our Sunday best. It was most childlike, but we were happy. The glares of outsiders mattered not. All that mattered was our love. Indeed. And no matter what people say, they will not get between us two. Not now. Not ever. Even if we're separated by life and death. One of us life, the other death. There will, we will not be separated. There we go. There's a freeze room. 
All right, unlock the door with a freezer room key. Maybe the game is too short so that we don't actually need any kind of um, save point at all. I don't think the game actually gave us like a like a load function or anything like that when we went into the game initially. Mm, don't flip the switch. Don't need to go in there yet. Ah. So, it would be another time within the game which we need to do that. But I feel like we need to be very inquisitive if we're going to discover the secret within the game. It'll take a while to get through this. There's only one mouth to feed. Okay. Gross. Well, look, sometimes we have to brave things which we do not want to witness. You know, doing paperwork, doing your university assignments, putting sun cream on the back of your mom's back. Obt item obtained head! Well, in this case, it was my auntie. Her face! Why can't I remember what her face looks like? Whoa. Distortion. If I were to see a painter of her, or if I were to view her once more, I swear I would recognize her face as her own. But if asked to imagine the same face now, it is not something I could do. I know she was beautiful. I know that seeing her smile brought me joy even in my darkness. Sorry, darkest moments. Even in my darkness. That isn't too far-fetched. But I cannot imagine what that smile looks like. Perhaps her beauty is beyond my understanding. Or perhaps... Perhaps I'm losing her. I think that's every piece I need. It's time to do the impossible. I'm coming! My love! There's only one mouth to feed. And that is her mouth to feed when she comes back to life. Something here... This could also be the secret, but we need to do something first before we can actually get it. Like, a secret is only a secret because there's really, really, uh, what you would call, this, not visible steps, but very specific steps. Not yet. Right, don't need to go in there yet. It's time. No, 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 no backing down now. It's time for the final showdown. Countdown, her mind. Ah, her mind, you say. Surgical tools. Oh, we we can't run around. Don't try and distract yourself with trivial things. What do you mean? This is not trivial. This is important. You remember to wash your hands. Which is good. Which is very, very, very good. I'm not backing down. Look, you, you're gonna... You're gonna get out of here. Is this a one? Is that for one? Look... Maybe I just need to really, 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 really push through this. Like, when there's a secret in the game, you have to try and think of the unthinkable. You have to do the undoable. Unless, of course, it's not scripted within the game, obviously. <laughs> oh, dearie me. What kind of secret would there be, actually? Flip the switch. Just a moment longer. Oh, we need to go to the back. Ah, oh, that's her brain. Oh, dear. It's a cavad... Cad... Cadaver. It's a cadaver, nothing more. I'm I'm pretty sure I'm mispronouncing that. And it's on the tip of my tongue as well. Don't try... It's not trivial things. Stop saying they're trivial. They are not trivial. You remember to wash your hands. Yes, okay. I... A brain. Which is also... Actually, used for the best blurred out partially like when it comes to really really graphical things you really do not want to have it fully graphic out if you get what i mean cat of air we do not want that to be the case ah the switch is to get her back to life okay we have her brain you're you're not backing down no one backing down. Not now, not ever. Right. Flip the switch. Just a moment longer. What else do I need to do? Ah, this is it. Deep breaths, Tori. Deep breaths. Three. Two. One. There isn't... Oh, there is a one. Ooh. Oh. 
I don't think you're going to get your friend back in some ways. M my god. It's... It's... Alive. Whoa. Hi. Hi there. I've missed you. I've missed you so much. Welcome back to the world, Elizabeth. But you don't know what her face looked like. Mind donor. A pretty interesting game. Well, I'm more fascinated to see what's next because that was just a little snippet of... A snippet, sorry, of what's come. Really interesting. Ah, it seems you've missed something this time around. Maybe look a little closer at your surroundings. Look, I tried my best, okay? Yeah, see, there's, there's no continue because there's no save point. What? Grab a brain ring. That's a secret? Hi. You can't remember her, what her face looked like. Her mind. Her mind. This shouldn't be in my hands. My god, what have I done? What? What? I couldn't go on without her. No matter the consequence, I had to bring her back. Her mind. All I needed was her mind. As I cut into her, I couldn't escape her gaze. Those eyes were hers. This body was hers. And there I was, mutilating her. This is wrong. All of this is wrong. But there's no other way. I have to bring you back. I have to. So please. Forgive me, Elizabeth. Wow. And that's that. Just a moment longer. This is it. Deep breaths, Tori. Deep breaths. So, a relationship between two people, Elizabeth and Tori. And you have come back to life, Monsmo. You've made this for me? Yeah. What do you think? I, well, I'm so sorry, but what is it? It's a doll. Ah. Oh, I see it now. That's its head. Those are its legs. Did you make this yourself? Yeah. D do you like it? That's... That's incredible. I love it. Tori, you're amazing. You... You really think so? Of course I do, silly. Why would I ever think otherwise? You... You're always so sweet to me, and I... I... You what? I love you, Tori. I love you, too. But again, her eyes being pixelated and all that. My god. It's... It's alive. But not the same as it was before. The mind is there, but the body's not. Because it's not Elizabeth's body. It's a body of a mannequin with Elizabeth's body memories and stuff like that but how would you even preserve a brain in the first place like keeping it contained in such a way so it doesn't degenerate or um fade away over time like a body does like it decomposes and turns into other colors and stuff like that as the decompos decomposition goes about so that folks is mind donor and wonderful little game there to the developer and looking forward to seeing what you have in store soon it seems you've found what i tried to hide from you good job yeah tell me to be observant more observant why not do you know who i am i like discover all these things whether i've either look up somebody else's tutorial of this game or not i actually had to do that because i was looking around in circles thinking it had to be at some point before putting Elizabeth on the table there. But then I looked up a tutorial and it was literally, you know, grab grab a brain and then go up and then you phase through a wall where you shouldn't and stuff like that. But that was a neat little game and I highly recommend this to anybody who is looking for a little RPG Mega Horror Adventure. Thank you so much for watching and see you all in the next video. 
for a previous video or you're going to repeat this video again because you click that repeat thing every time like listen to a song or something but thank you so much for watching everyone and take care of yourselves